If you live in Toronto community housing over the past two years, four times more people in TCH have died in a fire than any other residents in this city. I'm Cynthia Mulligan in Regent Park. That disturbing number came from Toronto Fire Services amid growing concerns about fire safety in Toronto community housing buildings. And we have more disturbing numbers in this City News exclusive. The report prepared by Toronto's deputy fire chief also finds almost 40% of the 11 fatal fires in Toronto during the past two years were at TCH properties. Toronto Fire responded to 51 major fires in the past seven years, which caused 24 deaths and 19 critical injuries. Out of those fires, virtually half of them were deemed to have violations of the Ontario Fire Code. This fire on Nielsen Road in 2016 highlighted fire safety failings at TCH. Four seniors died trying to escape thick, toxic smoke. They were all found in the hallway. One survivor, Fazila Khan, was visiting her aunt and told City News the superintendent banged on the door and told them to leave. Her aunt, 86-year-old Azima Safraj, passed away. Toronto fire officials have said the victims would likely have survived if they had stayed in their units. I still see her uh, when I identified her at, uh, at the morgue. Um, it's probably something um, that would stay with me forever. TCH pled guilty to failing to implement the approved safety plan and was fined $100,000. This is really raising a great cause for concern about fire safety in Toronto community housing and if they're keeping their residents safe. Um, it, it is. That's why uh, very often you hear uh, board members and the CEO saying that fire prevention is a uh, top issue, top of mind. Uh, mm -hmm. But has it really been when we see these numbers, these startling numbers? Uh, it, it, it clearly uh, has uh, finally gotten to the place that I think it should be. Toronto's fire chief was asked by the City Budget Committee in December to come up with a strategy to address fire safety concerns at TCH. This report shows he's proposing 25 new staff be hired to create a permanent TCH fire safety task force that would do annual inspections on all TCH buildings and provide yearly training for all supervisory staff. The cost, when fully up and running, almost $3 million a year. Now, we were told Toronto's fire chief could not take questions from us until after he speaks to the budget committee uh, later this month. And his proposal for a task force could go before council next month.